this one have extra. All right, Kenman here. I'm at CJRB Artisan Cutlery. I got Nico. We're gonna do a pocket check on him today. Yep. What do you got, buddy? Uh, quite a few. Uh, quite a few. Two or three? Uh, about, about. All right, Ready well, let's go. All right. So we got the neck knife. Uh, got the hummingbird. Oh my God, look at that Dead thing. Lock. Abco, Duckling, Seder, Fixed Blade, Fixed Blade, Fixed Blade, Fixed Blade, Fixed Blade, uh, fix blade. Uh, did you, there's the other one, Gravity, Fixed Blade, Stab Nanner, Auschwitz, Protec, Monterey Bay, attention to details. Ferrum Forge. Ferrum Forge. What is that first Ferrum Forge? That is the um, Archbishop. Wow, that handle's crazy. Then that's Arcane, Robert Carter. <laughs> Two in here. Two minis. Stinger. Mortis. Wife's grandpa's knife. Dude. Why wouldn't you? Stinger. Donut. And then I just got this as a gift. So no pocket space yet, but. Jesus. Check. Yep. Check, check. Not missing anything? Nope. That's it. All right, well, and now we need to. Oh, wait, one more. Oh, of course. I forgot. Secret one. <laughs> oh, the little mini pyrite? Little mini pyrite. There we go. All That's right. It. Wow. I've kind of lost count at this point. Thanks for pulling all those <laughs> out. What a nice spread. Okay, if you had to pick one. Just one? I know that's near impossible when you have no, this many. This is my wedding gift for my wife. Stop. Very nice. Second would be this because... Yeah, that handle. What that is that? Signifies is that signifies my made out of? That is titanium that's hand carved with a Dremel. And not an attachment, just a regular Dremel. Pocket oh, clip. Speechless. Bag. Speechless. That's. Barrels. Crazy. Flipper tab detail. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Insane. Hand All right. Carved. Wow. <laughs> Thanks for your time, bud. Of course. All right, Kenman here. We're at Blade Show Texas 2024 with TC Smoky Mountain Knife Works. We're gonna do a pocket check on you, bud. What do you got today? So I've got a couple of interesting ones. This is one of my favorite Protex right here. This is a old Blackie Collins design right here. Ooh. It is a gravity lock. So that button is not a button. All you gotta do is press the blade in, and it pops right out. What? The gravity lock is right there. You can see it right in there. Okay. And okay. So it's a little click. You close it in. And there's a uh, little ball, a little ball bearing right in there. You turn it upside down, and it locks in place. It's a really that's, interesting design right there, and I love I've it. Never Blackie seen Collins that at all. Brilliant. That's that's cool stuff. Um, I've also got one here from uh, Winter Blade Co. Uh, mm -hmm. The Mirage I got Ooh, last year. Yeah, I'm looking and, at uh, getting one of those. Sometime. I love his Ooh. stuff. 
dude is absolutely brilliant with his design. The magnets and the um, with the magnets and super smooth M390 titanium carbon fiber, all of it in one package right there. And I love that knife. That thing that is thing super is cool. Sick. And one last one right here is a new one from Kaiser that we're going to be picking up. This one right here, I don't even remember the name of it. Uh, it's not it's out yet. Then? It is not out yet. Um, but it is a blade? fixed blade in 3V, and it's going to be under 75 bucks. Really? Um, that thing is insane. 3V under 75 bucks. It's called the Smolt G10 with uh, micarta inlay on the handle, and uh, I would assume we're probably going to be seeing some more color combinations on that. Um, but as of right now, this is the only one uh, in existence yeah. left right now. So. Uh, really excited about that one. So Excellent. Well, hey, TC, I know you're a popular, busy guy here. I appreciate your time. Thanks Absolutely, a lot. Absolutely, brother. Thank you, man. Yeah. Okay. yeah I was going to wait until he was done. Oh, the new restaurant. Like they're all Velcroed together or something. I know, right? I mean, make it less convenient. Set that right on top of. Look at all here? these sweet knives. What do you got going on here? <laughs> so I'm, I'm, Alan. A, I'm one of their designers. I, 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 these are all customs back here. Okay. Can I film? Yeah, go right ahead. Dan, nice to meet you, nice Alan. To meet you. Show me what you got. What's going on here? So th these are just some customs. I, I, I bring stuff wow. to show everybody. Um, CRKT doesn't have any in house designers. They reach out to the custom market okay. and use us kind of design knives that they want to produce at a you know, more reasonable level. Awesome. Are you? Did you have something to do with the ritual I, then? I designed the ritual. Okay, it's a great knife. I've I've honestly thought about picking it up a bunch of times just because it's so. It, it's it's kind of over the top. That's what's so great about it. So this year at the but, show. But yeah, the new one. CRKT came out with the smaller version, which they just call the Ritual yeah, Compact. That is gorgeous. Now, does that one have the assist too? Uh, this model does. That one yes. does, but then this one but does yes, not. The, the upscale right. version does not. Go right ahead. Got my card on there. What's yep, the, the bolster? Card, the bolster is stainless steel with a, a PVD coating. Okay. So it does, doesn't have that copper transfer. It doesn't make your finger taste Excellent. like Excellent. Wow. I love the way this looks, though. That is I a do, really cool too. looking knife. That, that's, that's been in my pocket all weekend. I'm probably so. more on the non-assisted. Yeah, so, so the non-assisted is... Um, Just because I don't... It's a sandmine Damascus plate, so it's Damascus on both sides with a solid steel core. Stainless Damascus bolsters. A blue mylar carbon fiber. Okay. Gorgeous. Then on, on that, unlike the, the regular version, which is a stainless liner, a stainless bolster, mm -hmm. it's got um, titanium liners, titanium backspacer, titanium thumb stud, no assist. All so that, that's stuff. way that way everything works together. Yeah. It's gorgeous. I love it. Good to see. Good work. What is this? And that's the obverse. Okay, so same kind of manufacturer. That's an M390 blade, Ooh. titanium bolsters, liners, backspacer, and thumb studs, stainless hardware. A front, or uh, it, it's not really designed for a front flipper. But I, it looks like it, it works. You just, you just gotta get I used almost to it. got it. Yep, yep. I've got, there it's we go. It's super smooth. Both of the, yeah, uh, really the off-scale motors sit in an IKBS bearing. Super, super smooth action. Huh. Yeah, that thing is sweet. It's got, it's got a great action. Really, really, really smooth. Okay, and then you got at least one, a couple more. Man, you got tons of stuff here. Yeah, th these are not CRKT offerings. These are all my custom stuff. So this is kind of where we start with the CRKT right, right. design. Wow, you really... That is gorgeous. Is that, uh, what kind of shell is that? Then? That's Mother of Pearl. Amazing looking. You do some gorgeous stuff. Thank you. Very nice stuff. Sorry to just barge in and start filming. Alan, appreciate your time. Yeah, no problem. Good meeting you. Blade Show Texas 2024. I'm at the NAS booth with Ben. We're going to okay. pocket check you right now, buddy. What do you got? Okay. I normally don't carry three knives, but here we are. I've got a Sendy, a Lander 2, and a Lander 3. Lander 3 just launched Ooh, on Kickstarter. There it is. There's that one. So when is that that just launched on Kickstarter? Yeah, launched on Kickstarter. So that'll run for another like 20 days. Mm -hmm. And uh, then that will be available probably in the next two months, three months-ish, uh, depending on how things go. And then on this guy, that's a new Lander 2 in Micarta. And that Micarta looks that really nice. That one's not even on the website yet, so I probably shouldn't show that one. But here we are, rolling. And then I got the new Savivi Sendi 
in the yep. micarta with the drop point as well. Very so. nice, very That's nice. Pocket, Excellent. Man. Thanks a lot, Ben. Have a good one. Just get in there and go. <laughs> you do great work, man. Thank you. How many years you been going at it? Uh, about 14 years. That's what it takes. What do you say, 14? All right, Kenman here. We're at Blade Show Texas 2024, the Blade Binge booth. What's I'm up? with Eric. What's up? How's Eric, what is Blade Binge? Tell so, us about it. What's well, going on? It's cool. It's kind of a unique thing. So we made a uh, marketplace website for the knife community. So any type of like collector, hobbyist, knife maker, uh, retailer can onboard with our site in about 10 minutes and sell their knives to a community of thousands of people. Um, we have built-in buyer-seller protections. Um, we are seeing tons of traffic every day. It's a great place to buy on the secondary market with an added layer of protection. So just if you're looking to unload a bunch of knives on the secondary market or find a great deal on something, you can do it on Blade Binge. Excellent. Yeah. That is really cool. That's something I'm sure everybody gets uh, more knives than they want and then realize, oh, I might have to bin, uh, you know, yeah. Binge, binge out, out a little bit, and you that is where you're in. Cool. All right. Well, Eric, thank you for your time. I yeah, hope you, uh, you get a lot of good business. Yeah. Cheers. Thank you. Kenman here. I'm at the Kaiser booth. I'm with Michael. Michael, I'm going to pocket check you right now. What do yeah, you got absolutely. on there? So I got my pouch, which I carry every day. I got an Olight mini pen. Sure. I have that exact pen. Do you? I have the Kaiser Banish. Oh, Jacob look at this tiny Lundquist. little thing. And then in the pocket, I got the Riot XO Mini with Zergatai Inlay. That's nice. Dagger Blade. And my big boy today is the Cancept Delta. Very nice. Very nice. All right, Michael, thanks for your time. Oh, this is that storm hall. It's really nice. <laughs> so, VB button locks are great. Mm. 